<laughs> I don't know how they pull it off with it making sense it, because step one is they have to take back Malcolm Brogdon. And if they don't want Malcolm Brogdon, then forget it. So if they say, no, we don't want Brogdon, then there's no deal to be done. There's no way to get there with the other salaries because you're just gutting the team. Uh, if they say, okay, well, what are you, what else you got? Then the Celtics still need to get to $36 million in matching salary yeah. Uh, because they're up over the first apron, they have to match within 110%. So it's going to be pretty close to exact, yeah. you know, it's, and it's, it's tough. They can do it with uh, Brogdon and Robert Williams, but that seems to be a lot. <laughs> they could yeah. do it with Brogdon, Al Horford and one other small contract, but that seems to be a lot. So the technical possibilities of them getting there are, are just, they just don't seem feasible financially for the Celtics.